morning, it's Clive from Outdoor. I'm uh, with my friend Rich again. Today we're in Chipping Camden and we're going to do a circular walk. We're going to walk out to Broadway and then come back along the Cotswold Way, which I did at the start of last year. So this is Chipping Camden. So the start of the Cotswold Way is just over here. All that stonework on the floor. It's all pretty ancient, isn't it? This is Chipping Camden's Market Hall. Small market, but with lots of character. That's for sure. We just climbed up out of Chipping Camden, and this is Dover's Hill. So, if we were going to do the Cotswold Way, we're going to come back by the Cotswold Way. We go left along there, along the, uh, the top of the hill. We go straight up, and we're going back down the hill and following it around that way. As you can see, it's a, it's a nice day. It's a bit of a chilly wind, but that's all right. It helps keep you cool. And at the moment, there's not many people around. There weren't many people in Chipping Camden even which uh, is a bit unusual because it's a really hot tourist spot but it's fairly empty this morning see what it's like when we get back later it might be quite different then because it's bank holiday so there might be a few folk turned up we shall see huh? it's alright now just looking up that one's a top ball way so we can walk through there oh perhaps no I think we go down the hill Yeah. yeah I think yeah, it's yeah. down that way we go that out there must be the Vale of Evesham. And I think the hills in the far distance are the nearest ones but the further ones. I think they're probably the Morven Hills. We're gonna walk down in the valley down there. Walking through these woods at the bottom of Dover's Hill, and they're just absolutely full of bluebells. I keep taking pictures and videos. So you might get loads of bluebell pictures on this video. <laughs> There's loads of them. But we're not doing so well today. <laughs> Twice already, we've only just started, we've taken the wrong path. I, uh, I photocopied a, a 1 to 50 thou map to follow and uh, the detail is not so good as it would be on a 1 to 25 so uh, yeah <laughs> so we're walking back through these beautiful bluebell woods which isn't no great hardship really um, to take the path that we should have took but it's all right it's just See lots of bluebells. Made it to the village of Willersby, 
just thought we'd sit in the churchyard and have a bit of a break. But we're not that far away from Broadwell, I don't think, now, so... I'm sure we're going to stop and have lunch. Thought I'd nip into the church and have a little look. Quite a cute little place. We've made it to Broadway, which I keep calling Broadwell, because it just seems a bit strange. It's called a place like this, Broadway. Anyway, this is our turnaround point. We're going to find some food and then head back up the hill, up there, along the Cotswold Way, back to Chipping Camden. But the priority now is food. Had our food and drink, so we're all fueled up. Now we're going to head back up onto the uh, top of the hill and follow the Cotswolds way. So this is the kind of outskirts of Broadway that we're walking through. So up here on the right, we turn off and head up towards Broadway Tower. This is Broadway Tower, which is at the top of this hill. You can probably tell by me buffing and blowing. It's a 19th century folly. I don't know, I can't remember who built it, Lord, somebody or another. You can pay a certain amount of money and go to the top, which I imagine you get amazing views from. This is the view from the base of Broadway Tower. I don't know if you can see it on this, but it's kind of snowing, hailing at the minute. Typical bank holiday weather. Yeah, right? sunshine, cloud, snow and hail. This is England. Oh yeah. All those cow slips. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
quite often here when I'm out walking. Yeah, so that, well, when I'm outside, I hear them quite a lot. Yeah. I'm walking back the opposite way. Fields across all way that I walked when I did it last year. And it's really a bit strange and a bit weird, really, to do it another way around. But the other side of the thing is, I get to see views and lots of ends that I didn't see last time because they were on my back. And I took the other way, you get to see all sorts of different ones, different things. Some of it is really, really familiar. We've made it back up to Dover Hill now, so we're nearly at the end of our walk. Just walk along this ridge here, and then back down in Chipping Camden. But we stopped at this topograph to work out things. And it says Birmingham's over there, which we're both a bit surprised about when I thought it was over there. But uh, the Brecon Beacons down there and whatever else. Mulvans, yeah, that's it. They're the other side of them trees as well. It's funny what your head says is and what actually is when you're trying to work out perspective. Made it back to Chippy and Camden. That was a nice little walk, I think. I reckon it's probably about 13 miles we've done. Very pleasant countryside. And uh, I loved walking back across the Cotswold Way again, although coming back the other way. So yeah, it's, it's been a good walk. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it if you watched it. Well, if you didn't, you wouldn't hear me now, would you? Ha <laughs> ha! And uh, see you again sometime. Take care. Bye.